My first intention was to put something back into cycling after my career. When I came out here then and looked at the roads network, I thought, yes, this is the place that, that uh, cyclists would love to come to and want to come back to. I heard about it uh, with my wife. We heard it from a friend who had been here uh, over three times. We looked into it and we haven't regretted it. I think there's always a little bit of fear and trepidation when you go away, a bit of an unknown, but the very, very good, very good rides, good variety of distances and groups. Our groups always ride out in the mornings with two ride captains per group, so one will always sit at point, set in pace, and we always have one sweeping the group, so we never leave anybody behind. Each night they post the rides, and there's level one, level two, level three, level four, so you put yourself in whatever group you think that you will cycle with. So they look after you, you don't get left at any stage you're always as a group. We have like 10 ride captains here, we have uh, two ride captains going with each group who can watch and monitor you, how you're getting on. We all meet up at a coffee shop so you can kind of change groups at the coffee shop. We try and make it fast enough so that the fastest guy isn't getting bored and not too fast so the slow guy doesn't feel he's holding everybody up. The roads in New York and the roads are incredible. All kinds of little tiny roads and then the big hills and the sweeping Curves. You read sometimes on Strava, or on Twitter, or on Facebook about your star, Garen Thomas, Bradley Wiggins, all these guys doing these climbs during the winter time. Then you come along on one of these training camps and you can ride these roads. The routes are uh, pretty dramatic. Uh, the, the climbs are very challenging and the descents uh, obviously are uh, very thrilling. The important is that people will come here, they'll look at the program early week and say, oh, that's going to be difficult. And at the end of the week, they'll say, I've done it. The idea here is more or less for the, to encourage a cyclist to bring his wife or his partner. You ride your bike in the morning time, we're all back in by half past one, two o'clock latest. We really like the idea of staying in a single hotel and riding out and back. The other advantage is with my wife and I, she's a little slower, so she's usually in another group and I can go out with a faster group and that way we can both go riding and have a good day and come back and eat for lunch. I'll certainly look to come back next year and actually probably bring the family with me because I think the family would enjoy some of the facilities while I go out on my bike in the mornings. We've got a hundred rental bikes, all carbon rental bikes, so you haven't got to drag your own bike away with you anymore. We've got a following car which basically goes between different groups with water. We have partnered with High Five who provide us with uh, free electrolytes so our riders have a choice in the morning to either load up with water or free electrolytes. Our support vehicle carries electrolytes, we have gels on board, we have uh, nutrition bars, but we have a fully stocked shop with just about everything that you could possibly need. We have a selection of pedals in the, uh, in the garage, we have helmets in the shop for sale, shoes, um, our, our Stephen Roach uh, signature kit. It's very important for me to, to actually um, be here and I've spent uh, so many hours out here and so many miles on the bike chatting, maybe saying the same thing over and over again but the questions are never asked the same way twice. So for me, it's, uh, I get great enjoyment out of sharing my passion with other people that are as passionate as I am. The cycling is fabulous, and this particular organization is just amazing. It's just been brilliant. I would recommend it to anyone. The most important thing is that you go home happy, that you've come on a cycling holiday, and you've had the best vacation of your life, and um, you want to come back.